What's good, YouTube? It's the inspiration, man. Real quick video. This is quarantine day number, I don't know who's keeping track. Being down in down times, man. A lot of people know how that feel, a lot of people don't. A lot of people seemingly think things are up when things are not going oh so well because of the movement. They don't have time to sit back and think about what's actually going on in their life. But this here and what's taking place can be a blessing and a curse. This here is going to make you, that's what I say, the pull. Push or pull. This is the pull. This is going to make you sit down and reevaluate some things that's going on in your life at this moment. I'm telling you, this is going to make you reflect on the things that has been taking place in your life, rather be work or your relationship or what's going on with you you on the inside that's causing a lot of external things to take place in your life because a lot of the times people do the the blame game it's not me it's, it's you but everybody seems to have the same problem i'm not gonna go there that's a whole nother video but check it out our bodies were meant to survive they our bodies were meant to adapt and overcome our minds were meant and built in a way so we can figure things out in a way so we can come out on top, not stressful. We weren't, we weren't meant to sit and whimper about what's going on, whine, pout, be depressed, be stressed out, be fearful. We, weren't, we were meant to walk around with our chest out boldly, as men and women. As men and women, we must stand tall, taller than whatever situation has come towards us at this moment. Today brings its own situations and problems. Yesterday was just that. We can't do nothing about that. Only thing we could do is learn from what has taken place. From what has taken place. Only thing we could do is learn. We can't be stressed out about what happened yesterday. What we gonna do about today is gonna be the thing. It's, just, it's what's gonna make us. It's what's gonna build character in us. Whether it be a negative or a positive, what takes place today? Waking up with a mindset, it ain't easy. And I always say this in all my videos. It takes time developing certain things in your head. Once you always have that, I can't, I won't mentality, or this is not going to take place in my mind. My mind, we have to change certain things within ourselves. The mind and the tongue is powerful. How we view and how, I, how we see ourselves is important. If you think that things are not going to get better, even though when things get better, things are not better for you. It might be better for everybody else, but things are not better for you. We must understand that there's power in our mindset. Even when things are down, telling yourself that everything's going to be okay, everything's going to be good in the end, is what's, what's going to see you through a lot of things. It's going to see you through this situation that we're having at this very moment. Looking at things in the future, setting those goals, sitting back, visualizing a certain outcome is important in everybody's life. It's important. I can't sit back and tell you you should take everything I say and take it to heat and run with it, but these are things that can apply, that can build that character that we talking about mentally. You know, we must fill our heart up with joy. You know, it's a God-given gift. You know, we, don't, we, we, we always sit and walking around with this painful look in our face like the world is coming to an end. But I guarantee you, I guarantee you, a lot of stuff that you've been through in life hasn't killed you. And I know you got somebody out there saying, but this will. Are you in a hospital? Count your blessings. What are you grateful for? Not being sick at this moment. You know, praying for those who are dealing with this in their body. 
You know, if you got to be negative at this moment about what's going on, when you're not going through what's going, what that person is going through in the hospital, oh man, Whew. you cursing yourself. I'm just being real. You cursing yourself. Oh, that ain't. So I must enjoy what's in front of me right now. Hey, my bodies were meant to move. I may walk in the morning, I run, and do a family walk in the outside. Look, you can practice social distance outside walking with your family, a family event. You know, that quality time that we must spend with one another outside of the house. The sun provides nutrients to the body. Understand that. We was meant to move. The heart was meant to pump. You ain't gotta be the healthiest person in the world. Sitting in your house, doing some little push-ups, jumping jacks, or just walking in place will suffice to get that heart pumping. Because I'm telling you, what's going on in your body, and if you have an element that's holding you still, will get worse. I'm telling you from experience. I'm telling you that for a reason. I'm not just saying it just to say it. I have experienced some things, but that's not the gist of this video. I just get on here to tell everybody to stay strong, man. Fortify your mind, strengthen it. Strengthen it from the outside entities. Strengthen it from what they are telling you you supposed to be afraid of. No, hey, let's get this straight. I didn't say don't be cautious. I said don't be fearful. <laughs> I always say have faith in the end. Huh? Allow your heart to tell you what's gonna happen in the end, even if, you know? But if nobody told you at the end of the day that you're a great person, that you're a beautiful person, and that you love, sit back, tell yourself that right now. You don't need that. But I'm gonna tell you though, every single last one of y'all are loved. You know? Every single last one of you guys, I'm grateful for. I thank you guys. I thank my subscribers. Thanks. Thank you for the people that's been sharing my videos. Please continue to share, like, and subscribe. Being down at down times is the tool.